Excited, real excited for this season. Um, you know, there's going to be a lot of unknowns going into it. Uh, for the first time, we, we you know, we lose uh, some core players, and uh, we've got some very good new players, hopefully coming in and be able to, to, to bolster us up. So, yeah, a lot of unknowns, but uh, I think we've, we've established a, 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 a culture within the team and uh, some goals that we have for... Uh, for every season that we play. Well, I'm not a scientist, so I don't, I don't know how you do that, but uh, you, you'd, have to, uh, you'd have to bring in new ones and, and hopefully mentor them in a, in, over the period of time that uh, gets them ready for, that, uh, re ready for those roles. Uh, you know, we lost four very important players. Um, two of them were captains. Two others were very important players who came off the bench. Uh, you know, played all of them. Uh, so just going one by one, you know, Sam uh, was our big goal scorer and, and Sam Pop and, and, and Kevin, Kevin Hoof was, uh, you know, our mainstay in, in defense. And uh, the only other thing we could have lost, which we did, was a goalkeeper, uh, but he transferred away and he was probably one of the best in the, in the, um, in the GLIAC. So, and as well as had very, very high rankings in the, in the, in the country, I think. Uh, so. You know, those are the three big questions, but, uh, you know, we've got uh, players who were here with the program last year who will be stepping up hopefully into those positions, and uh, hopefully the new players that come in can, can push those players, and together uh, we'll, we'll solidify and, and, and be uh, uh, right where we want to be. I think we, we, we do learn a lesson, though, from it, because this was the first year that we had a graduating class, and... Um, you know, uh, it, and for every college program, that's a transition year. Uh, for every other college program, and they, they have that transition year every year. But we, this was our first time. So there's a lot of unknowns as to how we'll respond. Uh, but I think the guys, the leadership that those other players brought, Nick Corenda, Carson, you know, uh, Kevin and, and Sam, uh, they're, they're not going to be quickly forgotten. Well, there's a lot of people. Who, I mean, we, we played, you know, we, we had a, a funny season last year where we, we had a number of injuries halfway through the season and, and we had to put people in different spots. Uh, I think there were times when we had center forwards playing as right backs. We had uh, center midfielders playing as, as uh, center backs. We had uh, uh, backs playing as forwards. We had reserve players who never played uh, in certain roles thrown into those roles because of the, 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 uh, the injuries. And um, yeah, I think that's, that you know, leads the way for them to be, be, uh, have opportunities to play with us you know, uh, now in the fall. Uh, we had a couple guys that weren't eligible last year uh, that will be eligible this year. And so uh, I think that, um, I mean, to name names, I'd say you look on the roster and you can see that there's uh, anybody on that roster uh, for this season, we'll be able to play in numerous positions. Um, well, our goals are the same as every year. We, we want to win. We want to win. Uh, you know, we want to play well. We want to play, you know, uh, not just attractive football or soccer, but also uh, we want to play um, a real high tempo. Um, so that's, you know, and then how well we do that will determine whether or not we reach our goals. Uh, our goals uh, are always the same, to, to, to uh, do every conference game as, 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 a, as a championship game, to prepare us for what inevitably is, is a postseason um, experience. This year, I think our goals of getting to the national tournament uh, are, are basically going to be on, on how quickly we make that transition. Uh, but that will certainly be a goal for us. Uh, winning the conference will certainly be a goal for us. Uh, and as you know, last year we, we started out real strong, and until we had those, those injuries, it, it uh, um, you know, then it, then it became more difficult. Uh, but that's the, that's the uh, uncertainty of a college season. Um, uh, but having the experience that we went through, even the, the, the bad experience of the injuries, I think will be a strength for us, for the guys that are returning. Well, the GLIAC is, I think, uh, arguably one of the toughest conferences in the country uh, for men's soccer. Um, you know, we've got to, numerous teams who've got postseason national tournament experience. We play them twice a year. We only have eight teams in a conference. So, I mean, uh, you know, it's 80% it's of our schedule. 
And uh, when you're playing good teams week in and week out, twice a weekend, uh, it, it makes for a, a uh, you, you can't let up, you know, anywhere along the way. Um, so I, I think you know the Gleex is going to be an exciting, uh, an exciting tournament for us again. I think we'll rep, we'll have, you know, a minimum of three teams from our conference go to the national tournament, and so it's imp important that we win the games that we need to, uh, but we also have some non-conference games that are very important for us as well to get in and in terms of the at-large category.